What is going on Guardians and welcome back to another Destiny 2 video. Hey, in this video I'm going to be showcasing the Rat King exotic sidearm in PvP, specifically in PvP. Now, as I do this, keep in mind that in this video, I am not showing you any gameplay of this thing being buffed by anybody. It is just to showcase the base abilities of this gun and what it is capable of accomplishing. So, keep that in mind, this is not a buffed version of the gun, this is just what the gun can do in the hands of a good wielder. Now I have quickly become a huge fan of this weapon. It's actually not bad at all. So it's in the kinetic slot, it does not have any energy uh, you know, associated with it, it is not an elemental weapon of any type. So. I am coupling it with my favorite energy weapon AR, and that is the Uriel's Gift, which I will uh, cover very soon because it is incredibly good. But I'm using this sidearm in conjunction with it so that I can play my play style. That's the thing I like about this gun is that it supports my play style because it allows me to get up and close and personal, make sure work of people, and then disappear for a second and then re-engage. It allows me to insert myself into the action and not necessarily be instantly penalized for it, which is something that people in Destiny 2 are starting to gripe about is that because of the whole team fire uh, oriented gameplay they're finding they can't really play as aggressively as they would like to in destiny one well guess what the rat king is here for you yes you and me look at this i can jump around in the middle of all these opponents get a kill reload the weapon disappear because of the the intrinsic perks on this firearm i can do just that I, uh, I can bait people around corners, go up high, uh, take them out with the Rat King, reload the weapon, go invisible for a brief time, and that will allow me to uh, potentially juke out the second guy, and then potentially juke out the third guy, and in some cases, the fourth guy too. But TV, this sidearm isn't that good. <laughs> You're wrong. It's actually pretty stinking good. I am a huge fan of this weapon now, and I have found that its effectiveness is not limited to that, uh, you know, that intrinsic exotic perk that gives it the buff when other people are around you with the Rat King as well. It looks and sounds like it should be a PVE weapon, but I'm telling you right now. I'm having wild success with this firearm playing at solo queue in the Crucible. And I like it. I like this a lot. Look at this. Look at this. Guys, where, where did you go? I'm right here. And I'm going to take you down. And then I'm going to reload the weapon and I'm going to disappear into the night. But it's, I like the character of it because it is, it's sort of like this, uh, you're playing kind of like like a rodent, you know, you kind of darting in and out of the shadows. You know, you ever uh, encounter a rodent like that before? You're like, nah, where did it go? You're trying to take it out and it just kind of vanishes quick zips from here to there. And that's kind of how you play with this gun. You really do. You kind of zip in, you take somebody out, you disappear, and you, you zip away, get a different angle, get a different uh, uh, place to approach from. You got to bait them around the corners, whatever. I love it. It's just got so much character. So if you're not familiar with this weapon, uh, you can get it in the exotic quest line. It has several parts to it, but it's the one that you start on uh, on Titan. And I'm very glad. I'm very glad that I took the time to do this. Uh, make sure that if you are a solo player, you can get your hands on this gun. It's going to require you to do some teamwork and to uh, be involved in some team-oriented uh, quest lines. So you're going to want to team up with somebody. Use LFG. Uh, use the clan, the new clan functions and uh, you know services that Bungie has implemented into Destiny 2 to find yourself some friends, some people who are trying to accomplish the same things that you're trying to accomplish in order to get your hands on this gun. Uh, you would not believe what I suffered through to get this gun. I played an entire night of Destiny 2, several hours, with Mike, with M. Tash. I had to suffer through playing with Mike to get this thing. And I didn't go crazy doing it, so that's a blessing in and of itself. So if I can suffer through that, you can do it too. I guarantee it. So, get your hands on this gun. 
do the exotic quest if you haven't already and give it a shot try it out jump around and be you know like a kitty cat you know like I said jumping around you know what I mean and you're gonna find that if you play that way with this gun that's the that is the playstyle that this firearm supports and I think you're gonna like it so that being said guys keep in mind I do if you are not familiar with uh, me or twitch or my stream I do stream very 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 regularly like six days out of the week and I'm actually gonna start adding Saturday nights into the mix which will mean seven days out of the week I will stream at some point and sometimes I'm even streaming with my wife and she basically just sits there and makes fun of me and berates me and tells embarrassing stories about me the whole time so people kind of like that too so tune in sometime come by to the stream www.twitch.tv slash the true vanguard on twitch we have a great community there and we keep the stream very mature and oriented towards people who are pretty adult like so most of our viewers are adult working class people and uh because of that they may be watching at work they may be watching in their living room so we keep the chat nice and clean we have a clean policy so it's just fr uh, family friendly for whatever environment you're in come by and say hi we'd appreciate it and you'll see the rat king uh in action so do it you won't you'll have fun we'll see you later catching the crucible